Hello, my name is Shira and this is Q School TV. I have been teaching English for 20 years and students always ask me what are common everyday expressions we can use. So I'm really excited today to do part one of several series of common expressions we use every day. Today our topic is shopping. Let's begin. Q School TV. Okay, our common shopping phrase number one is bargain hunting. We use this phrase when we talk about wanting to find a good deal or something that costs very little. Let me use it in a phrase for you today. Hey, what are you doing at the shopping mall? I am bargain hunting. Again, bargain hunting means you're trying to find something that costs very little. Okay, our second phrase for shopping is how much. This is very common. We use this phrase when we want to know how much an item costs. So let me use it in a phrase for you. Hey, how much are those shoes? A hundred dollars. So see, when you say how much, you are asking for the cost of the item. Our phrase number three is, I can't afford it. So we use this phrase when something is too expensive. So let me use it in a common way for you right now. How much are those shoes? A hundred and thirty-nine dollars. Oh, I can't afford it. That means it costs too much. Our fourth phrase is it costs a fortune. When you think of fortune, you think of a lot of money. So when you use this phrase, it's because something costs a lot of money. So I can say, how much is the new iPhone? It costs a fortune. So you're saying that the iPhone costs a lot of money. Our fifth phrase is it's a steal. We use this phrase when you find a good deal or a good price for an item. So let me use it in a phrase for you. How much was your designer handbag? It was a steal, it was only $50. So it's a steal means it was a great deal, it was a good buy. Our sixth phrase is it's a bit pricey. We use this phrase when something is a little too expensive for us. So let me use it in a common way for you. How much is this car? Oh. $60,000, that's a bit pricey for me. I was hoping for something cheaper. So again, when we say it's a bit too pricey, that means that it costs a little too much and we probably won't buy it, okay? Our phrase number seven is I'm only window shopping. So this phrase means you're only looking. Think about a window, okay? You're just looking, so you're not actually shopping. So I might say, hey, you wanna come to the mall with me? No, I don't want to spend money. It's okay, we're just going to do window shopping. So that means you're just looking, you're not spending any money. Our phrase number eight is common to window shopping. It's I'm only browsing. Think about when you browse on a computer, you're just looking. So it's the same concept. Let's go to the store today. I'm only browsing, I don't want to spend any money. So again, I'm only browsing means you're just looking, but you may not buy. Our ninth phrase is, I'm going to shop around. That means you are still going to look for the best deal. So let me use it in a common way for you. If the sales associate comes to me and says, are you ready to buy? I might say, mm, I'm gonna shop around because I haven't made a decision yet. So shopping around means you're going to look at other stores for the best deal. Our final phrase, phrase number 10, is it's on my wish list. Think about when you shop online. Oftentimes you can put an item on a wish list. What does that mean? It means that one, maybe you don't have money to buy it, or two, you're not sure if you wanna buy it. So let me use it in a scenario at the mall. I may be with my friend and she says, oh, do you wanna buy this? And I could say, mm, I think I'll put it on my wish list. That means I do want the item, but I either can't afford it yet or I haven't made up my mind if I really wanna buy it right now. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Tune in next week when we discuss 10 phrases in the workplace. If you have a topic you want us to discuss, let us know in the comments. Thanks so much. Bye.